foot. Lower. Limb. Anterior axillary line. Midclavicular line. Lateral sternal line. Anterior midline. Figure 2.1 regions and longitudinal lines on the anterior. Surface of the male body. Note, 1, the lateral sternal line descends along the lateral border of the sternum. 2, other lines parallel to this are called parasternal lines. 3, the male nipple lies near the midclavicular line. 4, the anterior axillary line descends from the anterior axillary fold. Plate 2 surface anatomy of the male body. Infraclavicular fossa, deltopectoral triangle. Deltoid muscle. Pectoralis major. Muscle. Biceps brachii. Muscle. Umbilicus. Pectoralis major muscle. Rectus abdominis muscle. Figure 2.2 surface contours on. The male thorax. Certain contours on the chest, upper abdo. Men and upper limb reveal the shape of underlying muscles. LWBK 429 underscore C01 underscore P1 dash 51 dot 6 WBK 429 underscore C01 underscore P1 dash 51 dot 6 November 10th 09 425 and 31 seconds PM January 10th 09 425 and 31 seconds PM. Chapter 1 Pectoral Region, Axilla, Shoulder, and Upper Limb. Anterior Layer of Pectoral. Fascia, Deep Fascia. Deltoid Fascia Cephalic Vein. Brachial Fascia. Median Nerve. Fascia over Triceps Muscle. Axillary Sweat Glands. Axillary Fat Pad. Axillary Fascia and lymph nodes, lateral thoracic artery and vein, fascia over latissimus, dorsi muscle, serratus anterior muscle, pectoralis major muscle, external oblique muscle, nipple orgasm sperm, mammary lobes, rectus sheath anterior layer, costal margin, Figure 4.1 Anterior Pectoral Region and Female Breast Orgasm Sperm Note, 1, the lobular nature of the breast. 2, it extends from the lateral sternal line to the midaxillary line and from the 2nd to the 6th rib. 3, the breast is located in the superficial fascia anterior to the pectoral fascia. 4. Shown are the superficial axillary lymph nodes and the axillary sweat glands. Figure 4.2 Milk line and accessory nipples and breasts, orgasm sperm. Note, 1. Supernumerary nipples, polythelia, and or multiple breasts on the same. Side, polymastia, occur in about 1% of people. 2. These are found along the curved milk line extending from the axillary fossa to the groin. 3. This condition occurs slightly more frequently in males than in females and may easily be handled surgically. Milk line. Milk line. Accessory breast. Accessory nipple. Plate 4 superficial dissection of the breast. Milk line. LWBK 429 underscore C01 underscore P1 dash 51 dot 8 WBK 429 underscore C01 underscore P1 dash 51 dot 8 November 11th 09552 and 56 seconds PM January 11th 09552 and 56 seconds PM Jugular notch Shaft of clavicle, body of clavicle Sternal angle Infrasternal angle, subcostal angle, umbilicus, sternoclavicular joint, costal margin, costal arch, anterior.
anterior superior iliac spine. Figure 5.1 Surface anatomy of the anterior thoracic and abdominal walls of a young female. Note, bony structures and the umbilicus are labeled. Surface anatomy of female thoracic wall, female breastplate 5. Chapter 1 Pectoral region, axilla, shoulder, and upper limb. Figure 5.2 Female breast, anterior view. Pectoralis major. Muscle. Areola. Nipple. Areolar glands. Figure 5.3 Female breast, lateral view. Pectoralis major. Muscle. Nipple. Areola. Serratus anterior. Muscle. Note, the nipple and areolar glands project from the surface of the pigmented areola. Also observe the muscular contours of the pectoralis major. And serratus anterior muscles. LWBK 429 underscore C01 underscore P1 dash 51 dot I9 WBK 429 underscore C01 underscore P1 dash 51 dot I9 November 10th 09 425 and 36 seconds PM January 10th 09 425 and 36 seconds PM. Chapter 1 Pectoral Region, Axilla, Shoulder, and Upper Limb. Plate 6 Breast, Nipple and Areola, Sagittal Section. Cancer of the breast. Cancer of the breast usually develops in the epithelial cells that line the ducts of the gland. Delar tissue. Often, the initial clinical sign of breast cancer is a painless lump in the upper lateral quadrant of the organ. This may progress. 1. To invade the connective tissue between the lobules, suspensory ligaments of Cooper, and cause a retraction of the nipple. 2. To grow more deeply and fix the breast to the pectoral fascia overlying the pectoralis. Major muscle. This causes the breast to be less movable, and it tends to elevate when the underlying pectoralis major contracts. 3. To cause a dimpling, a thickening, and a discoloration of the skin over the tumor. The skin then assumes an appearance of an orange peel, and hence has been called the pole. Orange sign of advanced breast carcinoma. From the local primary tumor site, malignant cells spread by entering lymphatic capil. Lares and proceed to lymph nodes, where they may multiply to form metastatic secondary tumors. The most frequent routes of early metastatic spread involve the lateral thoracic end. Axillary lymph nodes as well as nodes that accompany the internal thoracic vessels lateral and parallel to the sternum. Spread of tumor cells also occurs by way of venous capillaries to larger veins and then to more widespread organs. Figure 6.1 Sagittal section through mammary gland of gravid female. Note 1. The radial arrangement of the lobes, separated by connective tissue and fat. 2. In the lactiferous duct system, each of the 15 to 20 lobes has its own duct. 3. The pectoral fascia separates the breast from the pectoralis major muscle. 4. The connective tissue suspensory ligaments of Cooper extend to the pectoral fascia. Figure 6.2 Right mammary gland. Dissection of the nipple. Note, 1, a circular piece of skin has been incised from around the nipple. 2, the 15 to 20 lactiferous ducts are arranged radially around the nipple and seen just deep to the skin. Fat body of breast. Lactiferous. Ducts. Lactiferous. Sinus. Nipple. Mammary lobes orgasm sperm. Mammary lobules orgasm sperm. Pectoral. Fascia. Suspensory. Ligaments. Cut skin. Margins. Nipple.
Cryptiferous ducts. Figure 6.3 radiograph of normal. Female breast. Lateral mammograph of a 47-year-old woman. LWBK429 underscore C01 underscore P1-51.910 WBK429 underscore C01 underscore P1-51.910 November 10th 09 425 and 38 seconds PM January 10th 09 425 and 38 seconds PM. Chapter 1 Pectoral Region, Axilla, Shoulder, and Upper Limb. Lymph nodes that drain the breast. Lymphangiogram of the axilla plate 7. Figure 7.2 Lymphangiogram of the pectoral and axillary lymph nodes. From WIC, 6th edition. Supraclavicular. Lymph nodes clavicle coracoid process infraclavicular. Lymph nodes orgasm sperm. Head of humerus. Infraglenoid. Tubercle. Axillary. Lymph nodes. Pectoral lymph. Nodes. Scapula orgasm sperm. Lateral axillary. Nodes. Deep axillary set. Medial, apical, axillary nodes. Infraclavicular. Deep cervical nodes. Infraclavicular. Parasternal. Mammary nodes. Lymph drainage to. The opposite breast. And to the rectus. Abdominus muscle. Subarealar plexus. Anterior axillary nodes. Pectoral nodes. Central axillary nodes. Deltopectoral nodes. Figure 7.1 axillary and parasternal. Nodes and lymph channels from. The female breast. Note the central and anterior axillary nodes. Also observe the deep lateral and deep medial. Axillary nodes more superiorly along with the. Parasternal and deep cervical nodes. LWBK429 underscore C01 underscore P1-51.911 WBK429 underscore C01 underscore P1-51.911 November 10th 09 425 and 40 seconds PM January 10th 09 425 and 40 seconds PM. Chapter 1 Pectoral Region, Axilla, Shoulder, and Upper Limb. Plate 8 Lymphatic Drainage from Breast medial, and lateral mammary arteries. Figure 8.1 Lymphatic Drainage from the Adult Female Breast Note, 1. Numerous lymph vessels in the breast communicate in a subarealar plexus deep to and and around axillary and infraclavicular nodes. 3. Most of the remaining lymph passes medially to parasternal nodes along the internal thoracic vessels. 4. Some lymph vessels drain downward to upper abdominal nodes, and some go to the opposite breast. 2. About 85% of the lymph from the breast courses laterally and upward to axillary and infraclavicular nodes. 4. Some lymph vessels drain downward to upper abdominal nodes, and some go to the opposite breast. Parasternal lymph nodes. Deep cervical lymph nodes. Supraclavicular lymph nodes. Apical axillary lymph nodes. Subscapular, posterior. Axillary lymph nodes. Anterior axillary, pectoral. Lymph nodes. Central axillary. Lymph nodes. Inframammary lymph nodes. Figure 8.2 Medial and Lateral Mammary Arteries Note that lateral branches from the lateral thoracic artery and medial perforating branches from the internal thoracic artery supply the breast anteriorly. From Clementi's Anatomy Dissector, 2nd Edition Baltimore, Lippincott Williams and Wilkins, 2007 Pectoralis Major Muscle Axillary Artery 
subclavian artery, deltoid muscle orgasm sperm, lateral thoracic, artery, lateral mammary, branches, internal thoracic, artery, medial mammary, branches, LWBK429 underscore C01 underscore P1-51.I12 WBK429 underscore C01 underscore P1-51.I12 November 10th 09425 and 42 seconds PM January 10th 09425 and 42 seconds PM. Chapter 1 Pectoral Region, Axilla, Shoulder, and Upper Limb. Lateral view of the female breast, and a dissected nipple plate 9. Figure 9.1 Lateral view of the female breast in a reclined thorax. Note, 1, the duct system originating in the mammary gland lobules. The individual ducts course forward through the superficial fascia of the breast to the nipple. Breast to the nipple. 2. The suspensory ligaments of Cooper, that separate the mammary lobules. These support the breast by attaching to the deep pectoral fascia. In aging, the ligaments lose strength and result in the characteristic sagging breasts of the elderly. From Clementi's Anatomy Dissector, 1st edition. Baltimore, Lippincott Williams and Wilkins, 2002. Lactiferous ducts. Lactiferous sinus. Suspensory ligaments. Pectoral fascia. Deep fascia. Pectoralis major muscle. Serratus anterior muscle. Figure 9.2 The dissected nipple and lactiferous duct system. Note the lactiferous ducts as they commence in the mammary lobules and course forward to open on the surface of the nipple. Also observe how. The ducts enlarge into lactiferous sinuses within which milk collects. Prior to ejection as the infant suckles. Areola. Fat lobule. Ampullae of. Lactiferous. Ducts. Mammary. Lobules. Lactiferous ducts. Nipple. Areola. LWBK429 underscore C01 underscore P1-51.I13 WBK429 underscore C01 underscore P1-51.I13 November 10th 09425 and 44 seconds PM January 10th 09425 and 44 seconds PM. Then finally, the front of the brain is the human brain, especially the prefrontal cortex. This is where rational thinking is. Now, when you ask yourself a question, where am I anyway? The answer is right behind your forehead. That's where you really are. Well, I have a theory of consciousness which tries to wrap it all up together. There have been about 20,000 or so papers written about consciousness and no consensus. Never in the history of science have so many people devoted so much time to produce so little. Well, I'm a physicist, and when we physicists look at a mysterious object, the first thing we try to do is to create a model, a model of this object in space. And then we hit the play button and run it forward in time. This is how Newton was able to come up with the theory of gravity. This is how Einstein came up with relativity. So I tried to use this in terms of the human brain and evolution. So what I'm saying is I have a new theory of consciousness based on evolution. And that is, 
Consciousness is the number of feedback loops required to create a model of your position in space with relationship to other organisms and finally in relationship to time. So think of the consciousness of a thermostat. I believe that even a lowly thermostat has one unit of consciousness. That is, it senses 